Hey little cowpoke and welcome to another episode of Scarfishes in Their Bed. <laughs> I hope you guys are doing well. Let's go ahead and check our weather on accident or spirits. Hello? Hello? <laughs> I clicked the wrong button. Uh, let's check the weather report for tomorrow. Gonna be clear and sunny and the queen of swords. Fruit salad? I don't mind that recipe. That's nice. <laughs> I'm gonna. Oh, I, I should check the casks. Don't think they're anywhere near ready, but yeah. I hoped, though. You can hope, even though you know. Um, <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. Ignore me. All right, I'm gonna sell some of my stuff. I'm gonna shell my little fishy boys, and I need to put some stuff away. And I need to check out the traveling cart person today. There's lots to do and plenty of time to do it. Um, because that's the thing. This game is about vibing, enjoying yourself. And that's what we're going to do. All right, I'm going to check in with the chickies. Hello, my darlings. And my lone little dinosaur, because that's not weird at all. <laughs> all right, let's get them fed and we'll go check on the cows and say hello and see how they're doing and the sheep and the goats and the pigs we have all kinds of animals over here and apparently a baby cow i can't milk you sorry zollers zollers i didn't mean, mean to milk the milk <coughs> i'm having a brain not work moment a brain moment the brain do not want to there we go is that all three milks yes Okay, everybody's been said hello to... Okay, I'm not trying to give you trash. Let's just get out of here before I harass my beautiful little baby angels any more than I already have. That was big lag. Big lad lag is so sad. I can't sing and I can't think and we're just making it work somehow. All right, let's pop on over to the garden and then the greenhouse. Then we can go to the ched, ched, the ched. That's what it is because I'm doing great, guys. I'm killing it. Clearly, in case anybody was questioning that. <laughs> Don't mess with Scar. They're killing it. Totally. Totally killing it. I fine. All right, let me grab some of my, my seeds. And replace what I've picked. I think it's some fairy seeds going. My dog is like, why are you moving and singing? Because he has now instated himself as I will sit on your desk while you do your scar -doos. Otherwise, um, yeah, I'm going to have a problem. We're both going to have a problem. And then I won't stop being a butthole. So... <laughs> That's what this is now, besties. <laughs> I'm being held hostage by my dog. You know how it goes. <laughs> All right, let's check in here. Ooh, -hoo! what is that? Is that rhubarb? Rubibbly doobity? Rububble? We got some garlic fatty. I've got to sing everything. You guys know this. Just deal with it. All right, I'm gonna pop on over here and get some seeds. I went to the wrong box. I need to fix some of my uh, fences today because they're kind of looking a little, a little raggedy, raggedy baggedy. Little ripperoni pepperoni, you know what I'm saying? Okay, I'm gonna put those away. And I'm gonna keep this garlic and the beets. Um, because I want to try to see if there are any recipes I would like to use with them. I will be getting rid of my wheat, um, and the pine cone, because hello, I'm a lazy bitch. Uh, we'll get rid of the eggplants, because they're just gonna keep reproducing, so we don't need those. Alright. Let's pop by the shed, and put our stuff away, then we'll go see the traveling car part person, and then I think I'm gonna spend some time trying to repair our fences and get things a little bit more in order um because frankly things are a little messy i still can't believe i don't remember my gal being pregnant and then it having a baby i am truly and i mean truly shook it by that if we're being honest here besties 
I'm just not sure what happened there. All right, I'm gonna put my little. I'm sorry if you hear any noises. My dog is being <laughs> himself. Whatever he's doing over there, he's making noises. You're drama, sir. Yeah, don't give me that look. You know your drama. He's looking to be like mother. No, how dare you? You're fine. You're fine, you little weenie boy. Okay, I'm gonna pop down to the traveling car person and go be like, What's up, bestie? How you doing? And give me something I need. Like a dried starfish. Yeah, looks like we're gonna be working around the farm a little bit today. Just getting some stuff done around here. My dog is so cute, dude. I... I'm obsessed with him. <laughs> That's okay. He's got the hiccups right now, so I'm sorry if you guys hear him hiccuping. But frankly, I think it's kind of cute, if I'm being honest. But everything he does is cute, if I'm being honest. So, crystal floor, poppy, coleslaw, parsnip seeds. Bunch of booty! I'm seeing a bunch of booty here, is what I'm seeing. You... You good, my little bro. With the little hiccups. Huh? You're alright. Alright, let's head back up to the farm. I'm gonna sell what I don't need. And we're gonna start working on the farm. I think we need to get some of our fences fixed. Get a little organized. Maybe clean it up a little bit. Got a lot to do. And it's already 12 o'clock. So... You know, daylight's burning, as they say. I don't know who they is when we refer to they, but as they say, daylight's burning. <laughs> Welcome to learn something, but not really our with Scar. Um, I know this is what you guys wanted. You know? <laughs> Old Scar giving you some knowledge. I don't know why I'm clicking. I, that seemed so unnecessary the whole time I was doing it. This is just who I am at this point. This is just who I am. All right. I can't find any room in there or anything that I want to get rid of in there that would... Some room. You know, I don't know why I'm making that noise. What does that even mean? <laughs> I really don't know. Just some... <laughs> room. Listen, I need you guys to just get on board with my sound effects because they're top tier. I, in case you were wondering, that was scary. I didn't like that. You know. Uh, got a big yard. Yeah. Okay. Let's go ahead and craft some wooden fence. I'm not going to craft too much. I don't want to overcraft. Um, I do want to maybe make some more steps, but I'm not going to do anything just yet. I'm not going to make any just yet, just in case we run out of time. Uh, we got a little bit of a clog up over here, and I want to take care of that. When is the last time I saw my girlfriend? Was it yesterday? I don't know. I need to see my girlfriend more often. <laughs> If I'm being honest. I'm a horrible girlfriend. <laughs> or partner, I guess, because I'm I I go more they, but I don't know. I don't know. Partner would be the gender neutral thing I'm looking for, I believe. Look at all these trees. Look at all these damn trees. Thank you, trees. We love to see it, but we just don't need this many trees. So what we're gonna do is get y'all to chill. I think I just cut down some uh, ale uh, fencing, but that's okay. Totally. Oops. Tell anybody. I won't tell anybody if y'all don't. You know what I'm saying? Okay, I am thinking about since we uh, we're gonna bring in this fencing a little bit. I think. Um, since we did get rid of the kegs out here. We don't really need this big of a fenced area at this point, and that will just save us on some wood. So, what I'm gonna do is tear it down. It's already fallen apart, so I think that'll be for the best. We'll start with some uh, some new fencing here. 
Yep, look at all this old, old, old fencing. Here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. I want this to come up. Okay, thank you. You're coming up with me. Alright. We're gonna go ahead and put some fence in here. Uh, put this higher. I do think I want to include the trees in it, so it'll still come out a little ways. Okay. We're getting the next little body. Body? Buddy? Little buddy? Little baby bean? Alright, let's see here. Here we go. Uh, there we go. That looks so much better. Fresh. Freaky fresh. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and grab, make some cobblestone pathway, and fix whatever's going on here, because it should be too wide, probably. And the fencing over here looks a little rugged. Uh, let's just fix that. And I'm not sure that we need this anymore, this cobblestone here, because it doesn't go anywhere anymore. So we'll just kind of, we're just kind of fine-tuning things, I guess you could say. Make some gates. And put them there. Here we go. Alright, let's go ahead and fix up around the garden. Um, because this is an important place to protect. We're just kind of getting our things in order, guys. Things are looking a lot better already. Just needs a little TLC sometimes. Just because something is uh, kind of broken doesn't mean you can't fix it. Now I know the saying is not really if something isn't broke, don't fix it. But the thing about it is, even if it is broken, doesn't mean it's completely unfixable. At least that's kind of how I feel about life. At least I hope so. <laughs> now I do genuinely believe that. Things can be broken and they can come back. Alright, let's go over here. And looks like we got some trees we can chop at some point. I'm not too worried about doing that today. I need to figure out where I've put my crab pots though. Um, because I do need to get a lobster. And I need to organize my stuff. Get rid of this. I'm going to kind of clean up some of the cobblestone over here. Because this is just kind of weird and unnecessary over here, uh, the way it is, so. We'll fix this. There we go. Kind of looking a little better. And then you can come- I heard that frog boy. He was like, ow. <laughs> Let me get my scythe out, just in case this wants to give me some fodder. Okay. Um... You know, I'm going to leave the outer trees on. I'm fine with that. It's more of the inner trees that are kind of the problem. Let's make sure all the fencing over here is good to go. And everything is looking all right over here. All right. Very good. See, not much at all needs to be fixed up. See, now I have some cobblestone path over here. It looks like it just got... Lightning struck! Uh, no, I don't want to make that three wide. We'll leave it as is. We'll leave that one as is. Did I want... Okay, I already made cobblestone there. I probably should clean up a little bit over here, just so that we don't have to worry about anything getting in the way. That tree's kind of in line with the others. I'm okay with leaving that one. We'll be picking these up. What I might do is just purposefully plant... Uh, a little mahogany seed here uh, just because it'll kind of go along the line and it's not like that's gonna be in a bad place in my opinion all right things are looking much cleaner do I have fencing that goes yeah I want to make some fencing that goes to my little lightning rods over here nothing too crazy just enough to kind of be able to walk along here. There we go. That looks nice. Alright, let's 
make sure there's nothing up here. Sometimes there's... Nope, looks like we're good. No packages. You know what? I don't think I've gotten a shipping crate in a while up on the beach, so... Sandwich. A frozen geode. I always kind of thought those only came during the winter time, so that was a little odd. All right. Farm is looking good. Good as it can. Which is great. I'm gonna actually maybe make my traveling a little quicker along the sides here. Where is it? I just want to make this a little bit of a quicker way to kind of get around the garden by adding a little bit of cobblestone. Which I don't think is a horrible idea. Nothing crazy. Nothing too fancy. Because to be frank, we're not very fancy here, I would say. Looks like there's just a big gap here I missed. There we go. And one over here. Perfect. Do I need more cobblestone? I probably do. I probably do. Let's make a little bit more. I try not to make so much that I just have way too much because sometimes what'll happen is I'll make too much of something and then as you guys know it'll just sit in the box and gather dust and I'm like why did I waste my time and hard-earned money to let that just sit there <laughs> but I I do think that <laughs> Stardew is one of those games that kind of gets you hoardy a little bit because like especially for um oh my god it's 12 the community bundles and stuff like that it kind of makes you like well what if i need this and then you're like oh i didn't need 500 parsnips oh okay but i i saved all these look <laughs> look at all these parsnips that i saved though aren't they they great y you like my parsnips <laughs> guys I have 400 parsnip seeds, too. What do you think about that? <laughs> yeah, that's <was> basically <laughs> the vibe. I gotta put this somewhere. I gotta put it somewhere. I gotta put it somewhere. What I might do is put it over towards the cabins. Maybe. Well, maybe right here. We'll put it here. There we go. Another little light up. Damn it, there's a cobblestone. And I don't have any stone or the cobblestone. That's fine. It can't be perfect, but the farm does look a little better. Just needed a little spiffing. Um, I really like the... I like our I like our little farm. I do wish I had more gardening room. I would say that is the one thing I don't like about the beach farm. In that, I know you can grow things, right, outside of the garden area. But you can't use sprinklers. And that is so painful. So... I'm just saying. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and hanging out. I hope that you enjoyed today's episode. I know it was a little bit more of a not as exciting one, but I still hope that you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you do something nice for yourself. Uh, even if it's just getting yourself a glass of water and drinking some water. Um, you know, it's kind of hard sometimes for some people to do that. I've been one of those people, so uh, make sure you're just taking care of yourselves. Do something nice and be kind to yourself. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, and I will catch you little cutie pies tomorrow. Bye!